So here, here with Blake Buchanan, just uh, talk about your background, family, where you're from, that type of stuff. Um, so I was born in Moscow. Um, I lived there until my freshman year. And then I moved up to Coeur d'Alene, Idaho for my sophomore year. And now that's where my family lives. Um, family, I'm a brother, I have an older brother. Um, he plays volleyball in Hawaii. Um, background, I mean, I kind of really got into basketball uh, eighth grade year. That's when I kind of put off other sports and I really got into it, started focusing on that. And ever since then, it's kind of just took off and it's kind of been my theme. Okay, was there a moment where you really felt like, um, or, or a time period where you really felt like, hey, I could be good at basketball? Um, it didn't really hit me till I was probably eighth grade summer. I kind of hit it and like I was kind of getting to the point where I had potential. Um, and then freshman year hit, I started on varsity. Um, that was good. And then ever since when COVID hit, I just kind of worked a lot. And I had people telling me like I have a chance. And ever since that hit, just, you know, I started grinding, working and now I'm here. And it's all kind of paid off. Okay, how much is like your your game grown over the past year? You feel like um, I feel like it's grown a lot, like because I I had a normal high school season in Idaho, um, and from March from postseason to now, I feel like it's ten times better. I'm able to shoot outside, knock down free throws, post moves. I got a lot more in my bag, um, so I feel like expanding my game has been really good, and then trying to get stronger. Okay, so I think it's been really good. Um, describe your game a little bit. What are some of your strengths? Um, my strength is in the, in the paint. Um, I'm kind of like an older style of player. I love being in the paint. Um, I like posting up. I like to go with my hook shot and then kind of doing a bunch of counters off of that. But like my go-to is my hook shot and then I have a spin. Um, that's kind of my game is in the paint. Yeah, I noticed a few of the spin moves you had earlier today and spinning quick and coordinated and yeah. hitting jumpers and that type of stuff. Um, what are some areas of improvement you're working on? Um, definitely dribbling and probably my three shot. Because um, I know at the next level, like I won't be able to play the five as much. And so I'm gonna be a power forward. So I'm gonna need to be able to knock down that shot from the outside and work on dribbling so I can handle the ball. Um, so that's kind of like my two big things and just getting more consistent with everything else. How do you feel like the three ball is coming along? Um, there's moments where it's really good and there's moments where it's like, it's not. Um, I like when I'm on the machine, I feel very confident and I get into a game and it kind of changes. So I think I just got to like put in my head that I can knock it down. And once that happens, I think it'll be good. For sure. Uh, what are some uh, underrated aspects of your game? Um, I don't know. I feel like I'm a very like unselfish player. Um, I like to move the ball. Um, you know, if there's someone open, I hit them. Uh, I feel like I'm good at passing out of the paint, which is a good thing to have. It's just people start crashing, doubling, just kick it out. Um, I think that's kind of where I get good at is then offensive rebounds. I get a lot of points off offensive boards. Um, so those two kind of things, and it kind of just opens everything up. Okay. Um, so dipping into uh, your recruitment a little bit, just. You know, what's the what's the latest with everything that way? Um, I just took a visit to Oregon State. Um, I'm pretty sure I'm going on official to Virginia um, during the season. But besides that, I'm kind of laying low on visits, just kind of talking to a bunch of different schools, kind of figuring out what I like, um, figuring out what's going to be the right fit with. It's going to be a college town, big city, smaller school. Um, so that's kind of what you got to figure out is what type of college experience I want. Yeah, ideally, you know, what type of experience would you like? Or um, I definitely want like the full college experience. Like I want to be able to go to football games. I want to have all of that, have it be really exciting. But I also want a college town. Like I don't want to go to a place where like basketball, but, like my college is like nothing in a big city. Um, I want to be able to have that, and have like basketball be the big thing at that school. Um, so that's kind of like my big thing and kind of getting away from home a little bit. Um, Destination isn't really a big thing for me, so just wherever the right fit is, but I just kind of want that full college experience. What about uh, in terms of like uh, on the court, like what, do, what would you like out of a college of choice? Um, I don't know, like what schools or like Well, in what terms of like uh, playing style or on um, the court coaches? I definitely want to be able to go to school like where they go through the post. Um, I want to be a part of the offense as much as I can. 
And if I can do that and go to a school where I can be a part of the, like the offense, like a big part, um, then that's definitely like going to be a big role for where I pick my college. Um, you know, what type of, uh, you know, when you commit to school, you know, what type of a player is a, is a school getting in Blake Buchanan? Um, they're definitely getting someone that works hard. Like, I love to be in the gym, work in, um, someone that's going to be a good person on and off the board, good teammate. Um, I'm a good student. Uh, just definitely like, I just feel like I'm a very social person. And, you know, I'm kind of I'm a little outgoing, kind of depends. Um, but they're just getting a guy that's going to work hard and, you know, their end goal is going to be that championship. Um, so that's kind of where I'm at. Okay. How would you uh, see your role at the next level? Um, I feel like my biggest role is going to be, you know, getting defensively, um, getting no boards, like getting boards is going to be really big for me. And then kind of just my part, like I don't need to be a big scorer, but like when I do get in the paint or the perimeter, I got to be able to knock that shot down. But I feel like my biggest thing when I go in is going to be good at defense and like all the, all the, like the little things and then scoring is going to come eventually. Okay. Um, if, uh, it's kind of a fun question, but if you had one hashtag to describe yourself, what would that hashtag be and why? It's a tough one. I don't know. Um, I don't know, honestly. I, I, We'll, uh, we'll shift to this. So if you had, maybe if you had four words to describe yourself, like on or off the court, what would those four words be? Um, you know, the work ethic, uh, plays hard, competitive, um, and then, I don't know, good person. It's kind of, that's a hard one. This is a tough one, no, but I like that. And, and I guess like you've touched on a little bit before, but kind of elaborate on, you know, why, why those four words? Um, obviously like I want to be the best I can be. And that comes with, you know, if I need to wake up in the morning and work out or any of that type of things, like if I want to be the best I can be, I got to work hard at it and it's not going to come free. Mm -hmm. So I think that's kind of where I get that part from and just like wanting to win. Um, of course, like that's what everyone wants us to win. And then kind of just my background with my family, um, how I was raised, how I was coached. I think that helps me be the person I am on and off the court. So I think that helps a lot. Um, and then, yeah, you know, that's pretty much it. Okay. Um, let's see. So uh, just kind of at the end of the day, like when you're done playing and, and stuff like that, like what do you hope to be remembered for on and off the court? Um, definitely like a good player, but like obviously I want to be able to have a good student, you know, like after I get done with college or high school season, um, I want to be able to fall back on like something I graduate with, you know, like this basketball is not going to be everything. Um, so I think I kind of remember for like the person that can do on and off the court that works hard in the classroom, works hard on the floor. Um, so I think that's kind of going to be my big thing is just how good my work ethic is and how far it's going to take me.